it's way day. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today you are here to check in on my way in. So everything has not gone to plan this morning. Let's just say, let's just say nothing. But Everything's gone tits up with my mother. Anyway, I'm sure you'll get to know in another video what's going on. Stressing me out. Not enough to eat, I tell you, but it's stressing me out. Now, this week, as I say every week, I've had a delicious week. I have eaten some really nice food, which you will have seen if you watch me daily. So there's nothing I've gone without. I've had full fat stuff, as you will see if you watch tonight's video, if you're not watching this after 5.30, when that will be up. But I made Tuscan chicken and it had full fat single cream in it. Well, hey, how nice is that? But you know what? It was delicious. We're definitely going to have that again. And the recipe for that is in tonight's What I Eat in a Day, Day in the Life type of thing. But before I go into my weigh-in, I just wanted to show you these. Now, I showed you these last week, and I've showed you them every week. But I was kindly gifted these weight loss charts by Winster Creations. Now, if you want a visual, which I do think helps, having a visual, if you want one, you can do them in most colours. Just pop onto the website, and if you put CASA15 at the checkout, you will get... 15% off your price now the prices for these they do meal planners as well and the personalized weight loss chart is 4 95 and you get a sheet of stickers with it as well that you can stick on like so you just stick them on as obviously how many pounds you lose but I find that a great visual and it's like oh stick stickers on this week you know and these little things they all help but the lovely Kaylee has sent me a further item to show you guys um, that she does. And I think it's amazing. I really do. I haven't used it yet because I wanted to show you how it comes without writing anything on it. Now, on her website, this is again a weight loss item. Another visual. Now, it's a plaque that you write on how much you've lost how much you are so far, you know, so far, how much you've lost and how much you've got to go, blah, blah, blah. So I'll put it up against a white sheet so you can actually see it. But it's like a Perspex sheet. See, it's like see-through. So it's a Perspex sheet and that is what it says on it. So you can have it personalised, whatever name. And again, she does different colours. Now, on the website, it will give you the option of having it with little magnets. There's some self-adhesive magnets there. So you will just stick them where you want to stick them. Personally, I will stick the magnets on each heart. And then when it's up on your fridge or wherever you want to stick it, you won't see the magnets then. Stick them where you like, but that's where I'm going to stick mine. But you can also have an option of not having these depending on where you want to stick it. You might not have a magnetic surface to put it on. But yeah, but aren't they nice? So again, if you fancy one of these motivational weight loss plaques, they are £10, but that is free postage and packaging. And you also get this pen that you can write on and then it's wipe, you know, wipes off because you don't want to be putting your biro or your permanent marker on there or you'll be ruining it. So yeah, you need a special pen which is it's like a whiteboard pen. It's a dry erase marker. But yeah, you get one of them. So all in all, I think £10 for that, the magnets, the pen, is a nice little thing. So check out these um, products on Winster Creations. I'll stick everything in the description box. And don't forget, Casa 15 and you will get 15% off your order. And she's lovely to deal with, so if you've got any questions about them, she will happily answer them. But yeah, so that is them. So, as I say, everything's gone 
tits up this morning. I'm actually just off to meet this guy that, no, no, calm down, calm down. Not a, a guy, this really nice guy um, to do with the kitchen um, because I've had two drawings sent to me with splashbacks on and the first one I was like, oh, don't like that. Second one, I'm like, oh yeah, I like that. And then sent it to Warren and he went, that's bloody awful, that is. So I'm going up to look at them and sort that out. Um, sort my mother out. My mother's um, banished from going out at the moment, which is probably a hint as to what the issue is. So I'm going to be going to Tesco's later for her. But yeah, everything goes wrong at the same time. Everything. Yeah, sticking up and all. It's getting that to that stage where it's it's a bit longer than it was. But look, sticks up. Can't wait until it's long again and I can plait it and do all the old jazz with it, you know. Oh, and look. Can you see the luck? It's not a lot, so don't get excited as I am. But my collarbone is thinking about showing an appearance because it totally went completely died and disappeared so yeah if i sit up like that a bit it comes out a bit more i'll have to go around like this but yeah i always lose weight off my face and my neck first but yeah i was quite chuffed with that hmm. anyway how did i do this week i didn't have an easier day this week which was fine i just had a few more extra calories every day instead of having one big uh blowout on one day so last week I was a 21 stone, yes, you did hear right, don't adjust your volume, 21 stone 11, biggest 26 stone 13, and what did I weigh in at this morning? I weighed in at 21.11, I've maintained this week, and I'm like, Maintain, is it? I'm fine with the maintain because, you know, our bodies are funny things. I've eaten really well. I haven't put weight on. I haven't lost any. However, it was a bit of a flick as if it wanted to go into the next pound down. But my scales don't do half pounds. It's your pound or nothing. So it's obviously gone to the, the higher than the lower. So technically, probably I've lost half a pound. That's fine. When I've stayed the same, I tend to find I have a bigger weight loss than the week after. So bring on next week. Hmm, bring it on. So I haven't had to adjust my thingy me bob, my chart. So £31 it's staying at. I feel thinner this week. A bit lopsided, you know. I feel thinner. I feel facially thinner um but yeah i'm not changing anything this week i'm continuing doing the same thing i am currently trialing something which you guys will get to find out about it's nothing to interfere with my calorie counting it's something will that will aid it but all will be revealed um yeah, so it's no tablets or things like that. So don't be thinking I'm doing some... And it's not Saxender. God, you see that all over TikTok. These girls losing stones a week because it's on Saxender. It's no magic cure. There is no magic cure for this weight loss. At all. Put me specs on my head. If there was, there'd be no fat people, would there? Like myself. Right. Quite a quick one because... I gotta shoot off now, but I hope you've all had the results that you wanted. And if you haven't, there's always next week. Don't stress and don't think to yourself like I used to in the old days. If I'd go for weigh in at my uh, club, um, and I'd stayed the same, or I'd lost a pound, and a pound's good. If I'd lost a pound, I'd be like. Oh, I've done all that all week and lost a pound. Sod that. Go home and eat the whole kitchen. You know what I mean? Don't do it. It's not worth it. Keep going and don't spoil the progress. 
that you've already done this week because I could jump on them scales tomorrow and I could be down two pound tomorrow, you know? And you do get that whoosh effect if you keep if you're stuck a bit and then all of a sudden whoosh and it comes off. Whoosh. So yeah. That's me done and I'm starting to rabble on about a load of crap. So I'm going until next week. But like I say, if you want to see more, then I will be on a Hoppers 5 every day just so you can see what I've eaten. If you agree or don't agree, then that's up to you. But it's food that I like to eat and I'm losing weight. Even though I stayed the same this week, that's fine. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. As always, and don't forget, if you haven't subscribed already, pop me a subscribe because I've just hit 3,000. So thanks to each and every one of you that have subscribed. And let's get on to 4,000. It's going to take me quite a while, but you never know. Right, see you soon, guys. Bye.